Good morning everybody and welcome to the very last assembly of this half term and what a half term it's been. I'm just going to do a short message today just with some, one very very simple but very important message and that message is well done. Well done to every single one of you um, and every single one of your teachers and all of the teaching assistants working in school and at home and well done to all of your parents and families as well. What a half term it's been. Shall we just rewind a little bit and, and, and think about what we've had to, to deal with and to learn about this half term? So it seems hard to remember and hard to believe that we had our Christmas holidays and then we came back expecting a full term, a spring term, which is usually a really busy term and a, the, probably the best term for learning, actually. And we came back and we had Monday, um, we had one day all together and then everything changed again, didn't it? And, and Boris came on the TV um, and told us that we needed to go into another lockdown, which meant that we had to close the school um, for most of you. So that was six weeks ago. And you have done a brilliant job, all of you. Um, if you've been in school, I think that's been tough, actually. You've had to cope with new teachers and adults looking after you, new classes or classrooms for some of you, uh, new classmates and new ways of working, um, having to sit at your own desk and use all of your own items and short play times and short lunch times. And I have to say, children in school, I think you've been tremendous. You've behaved beautifully. You've done an excellent job in all of your lessons and you've done some really fabulous learning. And I'm really proud of you. Really, really proud of you, um, all of you children that have been coming to school. And then there's the children who've done a little bit of both. You've been, because um, you've just had a part-time place, you've been coming to school on some days and then you've had to... Um, do your remote learning on the other days and I think gosh that must have been really challenging too um, to do both um, and to keep up with the sequence of your work and thank goodness that what we've been doing at home is the same as what we've been doing in school so I hope that's made it a little bit easier for you but well done to you um, and well done to all of you who've been doing your learning at home for the last six weeks goodness me you've had to do such a lot haven't you you've had to come up with new routines and be really disciplined about getting to your lessons um, and learning in a brand new way with your teachers online. And as I've shown you every Friday, the standard of the work that you've been producing and your learning has been excellent. Uh, and because we've been doing the same in school as online, I'm hoping very much that when we come back um, in a little while, then we'll all be at the same place and, and ready to kind of pick up and, and, and go again as a, as a whole class. And we're not quite sure exactly when that will be. Uh, we think it might be a couple of weeks after half term. So it might be that we have the half term holidays and then two more weeks and then we're allowed to uh, reopen fully for everybody and everybody will be back together. And it might be a little bit longer than that. Um, we'll be waiting for Boris to tell us what we need to do next but either way we'll be fine and I really do want to say a special well done to all of the adults who work in our school family um, because they've had to learn an enormous amount um, really really quickly and I feel very very proud of them and I, I know that you do too and um, lots of you and lots of your mums and dads <coughs> have sent me messages about um, how you've you've been getting on with your online learning um, and saying how much you appreciate your, your teacher's work there. And I know I'm very proud of the adults in school too um, for handling all of those changes so, so very well. Um, and I really must say parents, mums, dads, grandmas, granddads, um, whether you've been bringing your children to school or helping them with their learning at home, I think it must have been really tricky, a really difficult time. Um, and you've been magnificent too. I think you've done a brilliant job and thank you very, very much for supporting the children and supporting our school and supporting me as well. Um, so here we are. Tomorrow is a training day. So Friday is a training day and in school uh, we'll still be working. We're doing some more work on how to keep you all really safe and also some work on maths actually um, and some maybe some different and new ideas for our maths learning in school. 
and you'll be at home starting your half term holiday everybody will be at home on friday so my wish for you this half term is that you have a really good rest a rest from learning um and a rest from all those routines that you've been so brilliant at and that you find time with your families to do some of the things that you enjoy and I know we can't do everything. We can't go and see all the people yet that we want to see or go to all of the places. But you will be able to enjoy some some precious time at home um, doing some of the things that you enjoy and that, that, that makes you feel happy. So seriously, pats on the back. Give yourself a pat on the back. You've been magnificent. And let's have a little round of applause for all the people in the North Arran Primary School family. I'm proud of you. You have done a great job. Have a brilliant half term. There's lots to look forward to. I hope you will be celebrating. Oh, what's coming up in half term? Valentine's Day. I think that might be on. It's on the 14th, isn't it? Is that Sunday? So um, maybe make a card for somebody that you really, really love. That would be lovely. And then during the holidays, it's also Pancake Day, I think on the Tuesday of the holidays. So I'm sure you'll be telling me all about the different toppings and the different ways that you eat your pancakes, whether you eat it flat with a knife and fork or whether you roll it up. Um, lots of people do different things there. So lots of things to enjoy. Who knows what the weather will be like? We've had lots of snow. This will be um, the year that we remember. We've had a very, very snowy February, haven't we? And by the time we come back, it'll be towards the end of February. Um, so the months are going past, the time is going past, and it really won't be long until we are all together again. But remember that invisible string. We're all joined. We're all in this together. Um, we are one family. So have a lovely half term, everybody. Um, I can't wait to see you or hear from you um, when we come back in a week's time. So well done, everyone. Have a great break. Bye bye for now.